This is gonna be my five favorite finishing holds. I will pretend I'm trying to pass his guard here. I get control over his leg, my arm around, good base. I will slide my forearm all the way up to his heel as a break. His foot will stop my hand. At the same time that I do that, when I try to pull his arm, I feel reaction. He move his leg down, I slide my arm up. My knee now go through this way. I will lie down back straight in the leg bar. I'm here and pretend I'm trying to pass, slide up. I have him on my guard. I'll go for the very basic, very regular arm bar. I'll move my hips, slide my leg. When I reach this position, I lose his arm. Right away, this foot comes back here. I will hook behind his head. My leg come around, and I'll have this arm. a very good control. One foot behind the head, the other leg touch your foot. I will fake the sweep. Go all the way. He fights back. I have the omoplata. The best angle, I believe, would be if I go this way. Here. Okay? I'll be holding the arm. I'll be holding the same leg. On the same side of his arm, I'm going to be controlling one side of his body. I will swing my leg around. I can use the hip all the way around. I want to get on my knees. I use my hip to try to sweep him. I feel a lot of resistance. I raise my foot and I roll back. And up this way, sit up. Move it. You have the famous omoplata. Again. Everyone, when you mount, they want to defend their arms. They are very worried about you getting their arms. What I will do is, I will pretend I'm going to get his arm, but I don't want to get his arm. I will end up with another finishing hold. I will have both of my hands holding here, raise my leg, I will swing my leg around. But I don't have the arm. As he follow me, he will give me the triangle. The arm would just be a fake to get the triangle. Okay, here. I'll bring him in, look. Many times your opponent on top, a very strong guy, holding his arm over your shoulder, around your neck, and you feel that you're not going anywhere. What you need to do is, I want to see you hold with the top hand your collar, or put your hand on your shoulder, start moving your hip to the side. When you move your hip to the side, I want you to get your foot through this way. My shin will be across his ribs. I'll keep straightening my upper body and hold my own elbow. Now I just 
Squeeze my head towards my shoulder to avoid him to turn his arm and press down his elbow. 